Praise the Lord and welcome to Shawnee's Prayer. And as always, I start my prayer all over the blood scripture coming from Romans chapter 5 verse 9. Much more than being now justified by his blood, we shall be saved from wrath through him. Let's go to the throne of grace. Father God, I thank you for another day to be able to come to you to pray, Father God. Thank you for allowing us to come to you by faith and faith, Father God, knowing that you are going to hear this prayer, Father God. I pray that this prayer will be in alignment with your will and with your word, Father God. I pray that this prayer will be acceptable, Father God, in thy sight, Father God. I pray, Father God, that who will ever hear the words of this prayer, Father God, that they will be impacted by it, Father God. I pray that this prayer will be meaningful in their lives, Father God. I pray that this prayer will allow them to be renewed, transformed, restored, rejuvenated, whatever they need from you, Father God. I pray that you give it to them on today, Father God. In the name of Jesus, Father God, I pray that you will change hearts, Father God. And I pray that you will change our situations, Father God. Give us the strength in the midst of our situations, Father God. Lord God, I come to pray, Father God, because I know prayer changes things, Father God. How do I know prayer changes things? Because I know prayer works, Father God, because you have answered so many prayers for all of us, Father God. And the same way you answer those prayers, you're going to answer this prayer. You're going to make a way for us. You're going to open doors for us. You're going to lead us, guide us, protect us, and do everything we need you to do. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I pray. Amen.